We got there already, it seems. The Game Boy's first self-sequel, that is, the first game that is a sequel to an earlier Game Boy game. Nowadays, of course, annual reiterations of basically the same title are commonplace, with the likes of FIFA and Call of Duty banging out rehashes of worn old formulas over and over again. But to have two titles in the same franchise, in the time it takes to gestate a human? Not so usual in 1990. The first rendition of Boxel was a pleasant, if rather simple, single-screen puzzle game where you push crates around a warehouse onto specific tiles. Boxel 2 is, by all accounts, exactly the same fare. Little else there is to say about it, except if you somehow manage to beat the mammoth amount of levels in the original by this point without losing your mind, it was a simple task for Atelier Double to cash in and release a ton more. There's nothing wrong with that. It is just that, though, a cash-in. Apart from new music, it's still pretty minging, and an odd bit about an alien, it's the exact same game. It's like getting a new crossword every day in your newspaper. They're not going to change a winning formula, but it must take a certain fixation on a routine on your part to go back to it. Good for a commute or a lunch break, but not much else. So, for what may well be one of the shortest reviews in this whole book, we have Boxel 2. The original was a success and sold pretty well. The sequel was not produced in vast quantities, however, and as a result is considerably more expensive than its predecessor. That doesn't matter, because unless you're a completionist, you don't need this one.